Hello from 4 Biology chapter 10 video number 11 page number 10 okay we're going to start the title human circulatory systems but before we start the title we need to know our, about our hearts or oh, this is something similar with your form 3 syllabus can either form 3 in more young but today I have to repeat uh, because of the syllabus or my father okay so before I start we have to know the structure inside our hearts on the sing and we can continue our story on the okay right so when we talk about human hearts, we like to separate our hearts into two parts, left and right hand side. So also pain can use so pain. So there's a piece of muscle that separate our hearts into two halves, left and right hand side. And the muscle is called septum muscle. Label on your notes, page number 10, this is mean, label is yeah? septum muscle. Okay. So now where's the left and where's the right? If you look at the diagram, you just imagine I standing in front of you. You just imagine I standing in front of you. Okay, that photo of your notes is me. Okay, so this is my left, my right side, and this is my right, my right side. Okay, so our hearts can be separated into left and right hand side, right side and right side. Okay, and beside the left and the right, we like to separate our hearts into another two half. Upper and lower, sang min kan sia min. So cut again, separate again into another part, two parts. Upper and lower, sang min kan sia min. Okay. So now you can see very clear. Actually, our hearts having four chamber. Tapi tu, jadi ada sing chang, yo sega sing fang. One, two, three, four. And all the chamber having the name lah. Every single sing fang tu ada sendiri nama dia. So for the left hand side and upper part, what is the name of this chamber? This sing fang tu apa nama dia? We call it as left atrium. Its name is called left atrium. Okay, certain book left when orica. Atrium 比较适合啦，比较多人用。So left atrium, atrium 就是心房的上面，左手上面的心房啊。<coughs> And how about this? This will be left left ventricle. Ventricle means lower part of our hearts. 我们的心脏的下半部 ventricle. So left ventricle 左手边的下半部。Okay. Right atriums and right ventricle. You so pin the sang ban bu. You so pin the xia ban bu. So four chamber. The later four ge sing fang. Okay. So everybody having four chamber with different names. That I. For all the four chamber, they will be connected with the very big blood vessel. This four ge sing fang do have four very big blood vessels. So for the left atrium, it will be connected to the blood vessel called what? 左手边的 atrium， 它跟什么血管结合在一起呢 ？The name of the blood vessel is called pulmonary veins. Pulmonary veins. Always mean by pulmonary. Pulmonary mean fade. Okay, vein. 什么叫 vein？ 朝着心脏的血管。So 它来自肺，它朝着心脏。So pulmonary veins. 来自肺的，从这朝着心脏的血管呢 ？So pulmonary vein 就是这一条血管。Okay, and for the left ventricle, left ventricle, 心脏的左手边下半部 it is connected to to the biggest blood vessel in our body. 它接跟我们整个身体里边最大条的一条血管 And what's the name? 它的名字叫什么呢？就叫血管之王啊。Sorry, 没有这样子的名字了 We call it as aorta. 它的名字就叫 aorta, 动脉之王最大条的动脉就叫 aorta. Okay, next. And for the right atrium, so also being the same means is connected to what? It is connected to the vena cava. Always mean by vena cava, the biggest vein of the vena cava. Okay. And the right, the last right ventricle will be connected to the lung again. It will also be connected to the lung. So the blood vessel will be called fade pulmonary artery. So pulmonary is fade. Artery means away from heart, leave the heart. So pulmonary artery is to leave the heart, to go to the heart. Okay, pulmonary vein is to go to the heart, and then to the heart of the heart. So four chamber connected with the four blood vessels. Four heart vessels, four heart vessels. Okay, and not enough. We can't finish our diet. There are four vessels. Open the valve, which is the open valve. Okay, so where's the valve? Where are the four open valves? Come on, let's see the names of the names. 
between the left atrium and left ventricle， 在 left atrium 跟 left ventricle 之间 ，it contains a valve and the name is here， 它的名字就叫 bicuspid valve。bicuspid valve， OK， the name is bicuspid valve。Okay, and now on the right hand side, you saw being between the right atrium and right ventricle, it contains another valve. 这边还有另外一个 valve, and the name is called tricuspid valve. 它的名字就叫 tricuspid valve. Okay, 三个 valve 的 Next, 三 Okay, sorry, sorry, tricuspid valves. Next, and between your heart and other part of your body. Between your heart and other part of your body, it contains another two valves at the center. 中间还有两个的 valve, and these two, 这两个 valve, we call semi-duodenal valve, 半叶形的 valve. Okay, same name, 两个名字一样的 semi-duodenal valve. So four chamber for blood pressure. Okay, and we having four valve inside the heart. 还有四大的阀门 So 四大心房，四大血管，还有四大开关在这边呢。Valve 就是开合关，开合关的东西。Valve， 你开水龙头，那个水龙头就叫 Valve。你关水龙头，水龙头也叫 Valve。So 四大心房，四大血管和四大的开关。Understands？ So this is our basic our, of of our hearts， 我们的心脏的 basic unit 啦。Okay, so now you turn to page number nine. You turn to the page nine. We start again about the heart structure. We then look at our heart structure. We look at our heart structure. And after this, we can continue the title further. We can talk more and more about the story. So, bio is actually very tired. Bio stories are many. We talk about the mouth, right? Chemistry is better. We talk about the mouth. 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 Okay, so bye bye. See you in the next video.